Here's everything you need to know about drifting in any Mazda Miata because anything is possible, okay? And if you believe me, you can believe anybody on the internet. There's a guy that turned one into a motorcycle for Christ's sake. So as long as you have a limited slip differential, a manual transmission, and a clutch that can take a little bit of abuse, you should be okay. We'd probably recommend upgrading the clutch because the stock clutch is kind of dog shit. And we'd recommend in addition to that, you get some skinnier tires that can break loose because the power band on these cars is teeny tiny. With some decent coilovers to limit rollover, a good clutch kick initiation, and letting the tires burn while keeping the throttle practically smashed, and you will be able to drift the tiny little coupe convertible. Not the easiest one to drift, and it wasn't really intended for that to begin with. So for a drift score, we give it a 6 out of 10.